Well, joining us from Silicon Valley is the BBC's Alistair Leithhead. And Alistair, this is one of the most eagerly anticipated share flotations in recent stock market history. What can we expect? Well, certainly is. There's an awful lot of excitement, certainly here in Silicon Valley and among the investors. Many of those, of course, who got in very early will stand to make a vast amount of money. They say thousands of people will become millionaires or multimillionaires and a handful will become billionaires simply overnight when st shares start being traded in New York. And that will open from here when Mark Zuckerberg, of course, the founder of Facebook, will um, ring the bell uh, remotely uh, from Silicon Valley. And then we'll know whether or not that share price really is going to leap up, whether a lot of people will make a lot of money. And then, of course, how long might that share price stay up for? Well, exactly, because Facebook generated a $1 billion profit last year. So how can it justify this enormous price tag? What it comes down to is the potential, potential certainly for advertising sales. For the ad men, this is the perfect business. It's got a huge amount of data associated with it, and it identifies a specific market of people. It can pick on groups of people to sell its advertising directly to. That's the theory. That hasn't been totally proven and tested as yet, but they believe there's enough potential for this to work. And Mark Zuckerberg, he's going to become one of the world's richest men overnight, but he also wants to plow billions of dollars back into the company to generate this money, to try and take it where he wants, which is even further. 900 million users at the moment, he wants it over a billion and beyond. He wants to go into the Chinese market, uh, he wants to try and take Facebook forward to be even more part of people's lives across the world. And that's why he's prepared to spend money to try and do it. And he's going to get that money from this huge share valuation. Alistair Leithhead from Silicon Valley, thank you very much.